In today's video, we're gonna be going over the Jupiter alkaline ionized water technology and see if it makes hydrogen gas. So if you haven't already been aware, the only reason to drink alkaline ionized water or electrolyzed reduced water is the molecular hydrogen in it. And so what we've got here for you, if you just look right below, there'll be some research articles. This is 10 years of research that, that proves that. No reason to drink alkaline ionized water except for the hydrogen. That means if you've heard alkaline water is good for you coming from this device, it doesn't matter. You can take the hydrogen out of this and the studies say there's no benefit to the water. It's not the alkalinity, it is the hydrogen. So that being said, we're gonna also check Healthy Hydration's Hydro Deluxe. So this is a device that's designed to make hydrogen, whereas this one is designed to make alkaline water. So this is gonna be similar to what you find in here. These are quite a few plates. This one has five electrodes inside, okay? So five electrodes, but this is what the technology looks like. They're negative and positively charged. The water goes through and it splits the water into alkaline, and then you have acidic water going out the bottom. There is a downfall to that, as it's not consistent hydrogen. Also, there's cleaning and maintenance power with uh, Jupiter. The manufacturer says just push the button and it cleans itself. They reverse the player to the plates, which is great, but a lot of technology out there does not do that. So the calcium will build up inside. So you wanna definitely be careful with that. Now this is the hydrogen technology here. Now this is similar to what's inside the Hydrolux, but not specifically. You typically have a PEM membrane and you just have two electrodes, a negative and a positive, an anode and a cathode, and then a PEM inside here, which is gonna make the hydrogen. And then it goes into a port up here, which is called a dissolver, and it dissolves the hydrogen water into this port and then you drink it. So you're getting hydrogen infused in the water, which is much more stable in the body. We also have nano hydrogen technology over here and apparently just the hydrogen technology here. So first thing we're gonna do is we are gonna turn it on. And on these ionizers, the slower the water flow goes, the more concentrated the pH becomes, but also the hydrogen as well. The research also suggests that anything over a 9.8 pH will break down the platinum in the unit. So we wanna be careful with that, so not going too slow. So here will be a good range. We're on the drinking water portion here. So what we're gonna do is we are going to fill this beaker up here. We wanna get to about six milligrams, which we are about there. And now the therapeutic concentration that you need in order to get a result in your health is five of these drops. So we're gonna do one, and we want it to go clear. And if it does not go clear, that means there's no presence of hydrogen. So here, at the drinking water setting, there's no hydrogen present. Just for fun, let's go ahead and go up to the cooking, which is gonna be the highest of all the levels that they have. And we'll test it again. Now this would definitely be unsafe for drinking because it is very high in the pH, and of course that platinum can come off. Now these are pH drops. I just wanna show you that. That's purple, that means it's very, very, very alkaline. And now we'll do the hydrogen. Okay, and now the hydrogen. So we'll just do one to start. And see what we have here. So even in the highest setting here, we have no molecular, actually there's actually maybe one. Yes, there is one there. So remember, you need five for a therapeutic dose unless you're planning on drinking like five gallons of this water. And you aren't drinking the cooking water, by the way. <laughs> you're drinking the drinking water. So the cooking water, if you're cooking, might have a little bit of hydrogen in it. Okay, so there's definitely not two, but there was one drop, okay? Let's go ahead and turn it off over here, switch gears. We'll come over to the Hydro Deluxe. And so with this technology, there's a built-in RO system. So there's a three-stage RO, there's a port here, which is a dissolver, it's gonna dissolve the water with the hydrogen, so you get more concentration. And then the port over here is gonna make the hydrogen. That water that goes to make electrolysis or go through the chambers here, does not come in contact with your drinking water. So you don't worry about any of the platinum coming off into your drinking water. We also get really, really hot water here, up to 204 degrees. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and Get our hydrogen here. Okay. It has a UV light as well. All right, so we're gonna start with one drop like we did over here with the Jupiter. And there's one. Just put a couple.
couple more. Two, three, four, five. And there's five. Now that would be the therapeutic dose per liter of water that you consume. So five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And there is actually a scientific way to do this called gas chromatography. This unit has been certified to get about 2.9 parts per million, so it'd be about 29 drops. So here we have, again, the hydrogen. So as you can see here, it's definitely quite a lot of difference. So if you're looking to maximize the water that you consume and not having to drink gallons upon gallons, then the Hydro Deluxe is going to serve you best. I also will check the pH here, because as we have reverse osmosis, it's taking out contaminants like fluoride and arsenic and nitrates. So it's gonna be more on the acidic neutral side, which is good because you can just add minerals to your water or just eat more organic fruits and vegetables if you're worried about the minerals. Now you cannot take acid water and put it through an alkaline ionized technology because there's just no minerals to conduct. And one thing I also want to share with you is that when you do have alkaline water technology, the water that you're drinking, the alkalinity, is not stabilized. So as you consume it here, I'll show you using a little bit of lemon, the pH, as soon as it goes into your stomach, will be completely neutralized. So there's absolutely no benefit to alkaline ionized water, except for the hydrogen. You can take baking soda, put it in your water to get alkaline water, that will be a buffer. So this is just lemon, it's very acidic. As you'll see here, it will change back to acid, which our stomach is acid. So there you have it, the Jupiter Water Ionizer compared to the Hydra Deluxe.